And now for our feature presentation. This is Angelica Curves, and we're here at BowtieSouth.com if you want to go check them out. And you're watching OzoneMag.com. No words, I describe them with letters best. They pretty as can be, curvy as the letter S. They keep it G, they sweet as T. So we're sitting here with Angelica Curves. How are you, ma'am? Hello. What's going on with you? Nothing, chilling. You know what I mean? I mean, um, where are we at right now? We're at Bowtie South. Mm -hmm. It's a car shop in Miami. Mm -hmm. So they let us come and interview, have you guys here. Oh, definitely. So, so. I'll show you a little bit later on when we get to walk. And um, see that's... all the little nice, really hot cars. <laughs> I'm sure you like. That's what it is, man. So, I mean, Angelica Curves, with a name like that, you know, obviously your figure is on point. So we're trying to say, like, um, that's what it is, man. So what... How does Angelica maintain her curves? Actually, it's a lot of hard work. Like, I have a personal trainer. Mm -hmm. I get two days off a week, and um, I'm constantly training. So, with your curves, where have they taken you? Like, I've seen you in some videos, so you mind? Yeah, I've got booked a couple of videos, uh, calendars, magazines. Um, a lot of the stuff you can go online and look up Angelica Curves. But um, if you want to know, like, the latest a video that I did was, um, I think it was Pitbull with um, Arnold Rebel, and mm -hmm. it's called um, You Don't See Me or I Can't See You. I don't remember the song right now. But I just did um, Calle Ocho um, before that. Um, Black Friends 40 on 40 is out right now. Lowrider, and the next one is gonna be Girls of Lowrider. So oh, definitely, definitely. I mean, that's what it is. So I mean, tell us, what, what do you do besides when, I, when you're not modeling? I'm actually here. You're oh. gonna see all the little toys that I play with when mm -hmm. I'm not on set. We're doing one of my photo shoots. So toys. <laughs> you would like them too. I bet you watch. That's what's up. One of my favorite, favorite all toys. It's an excursion. Wow. And it's called the American Badass Truck. Yeah. Well, they do that at. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So, Angelica, you like to play with big toys when you're not modeling. So, what, mm, what do you have coming up? few things that are in the works right now I'm working on my calendar it's gonna be something that's real simple I don't want something real big but I want um, something that all my fans like right now we're in a recession so um, I want something that my fans will be able to you know support and, and like. um, the calendar will include a DVD also that will be free with the calendar so that will be coming up soon and um, I have another project that's in the works and I can't talk about it but I'm like really excited like really really excited about it um, right now we have like three sponsors that are on board and it's something that's like completely out of the box and nobody has done so I'm really excited about it and once it comes out I will let everybody know. Damn right. So I mean but speaking of the recession, how has it has it affected your modeling? Like has it like really like, you know, knocked you off course or is like or is it like kind of put your focus on something else? I don't know, like um when we did the Lady Hennessy store, it was kind of funny because they were, that was a joke, oh, what recession? But um, I think like throughout, you always have somebody that's going to touch you that's been through it. I have a sister that, you know, she lost a job. She's been going on her mission. So I think somehow the recession has impacted someone, you know, somehow. However, it, nobody's untouchable. So mm -hmm. somehow you have a, re you know, a relative or someone close to you that has been affected by this recession. And hopefully, you know, we come out of it. So is that the sister that, you know, takes a frustration out on you by personal training? Yeah, right? No, I have five sisters. Wow. I believe that. Do they all look like you? Um, yeah, we all sort of look alike. Oh, that's what's up, man. See what I mean? We're all cuties. So it's five reasons to come to Miami. That's yeah, what's up, go. man, you know? So that's what it is, man. Uh, so The recession, as far as um, the Lady Hennessy tour, um, what they wanted to do was do a customer appreciation. Um, Thing, like nationwide so what we would do was go to the store so what we would do was some of these like some of the customers that would purchase Tennessee even if they couldn't get a bigger bottle they would actually be loyal enough to buy a little bottle so that was kind of cool like people were just like they wouldn't switch off because something else was cheaper or whatever they would actually be loyal to the Hennessy brand and, and would purchase it and so we were just there to give them that extra support you know they were really excited when we would come by like some people couldn't even talk they were like starstruck but it was kind of cool like I liked it Oh, definitely. So you and the other girls, y'all, you guys, all got along on the tour. Yeah, there was no like everybody was cool. Mm -hmm. Um, I I got to sit down and speak to Melissa a lot during our last like dinner, which she was really cool. She's a real good person. It was pretty cool to like actually meet her mm -hmm. and like interact with her. 
from one vixen to another, how would you say, like, you know, I mean, because she, is there something she taught you, or is there something like you might have learned from her, or some, um, any advice? I think Melissa, um, in a lot of ways, she's inspired me because she's like I see her as she's a boss, like. You know, she does what she needs to do, and if it's not her way, she's no other way, and she doesn't let people, you know, walk all over her. And I, you know, I salute her for that. And that's cool. Takara so Jones is another one. She's beautiful, fabulous. She was the biggest sweetheart ever. I was real happy to meet her too. And um, her makeup artist, Kai, she was the shit. Um, Dolicia was very nice. Um, who was the other one? Reagan Gomez was a sweetheart too. they I think they're related. They're like cousins. And Miss Isa was on for the first part of the tour. She was cool. Like everybody was cool. I like that. It was no, you know, no diva stuff and no like, you know, it was cool. It was a good experience to That's work with other people that actually are in my industry, trying to, you know. Well, definitely, yeah. man. So. The female bosses. Yeah. All right. Cool. <laughs> so we're gonna see you at any award shows, anything like that, any, in the top, in the future. I don't know. Let's see. Mm -hmm. I'll keep y'all updated. But you can always check out my site. Um, I keep everybody informed. Right now, I'm gonna start you streaming. A lot more. Uh, one of my girlfriends from down here, Miss Day County, she's the one that put me onto that. So we're gonna have our first like live TV thing tomorrow. We're gonna play against um, One Chance. Mm -hmm. So on a game of basketball. <laughs> D can't play, but somehow we're gonna make it happen. Definitely, man. So oh, you're on Twitter too. Yeah, Twitter, Angelica Curves. Oh, definitely, man. Yeah. Well, once you go onto my website, AngelicaCurves.com, you'll see like I have all the links to everything else. Or you could just Google me, and it's that much easier. So definitely, that's what it is, man. Well, any shout outs? Yeah, definitely. I got my friends, my family, um, Bow Tie South, which has been a big supporter, Casper from Casper Marketing, um, Zoila, my PR, The Link 305, and who else? Doughboy, um, all the photographers that I work with. Um, Mark Quest from Orlando has done an amazing job. He's the one working on my calendar, so I'm really excited to work with him. He's a cool dude. Um, you'll see that coming soon. And my friends and family and my fans. Thank you for keeping me inspired and motivated. I hope I, did, I do the same to you guys. The week is called my day, so it's my say. Pass my cage, I'm through talking.